hi everyone welcome back to stuff about tutorials in this video we will see how to create an account on Evernote also I wonder why you want to create an account on Evernote maybe because your friends are using it so you also want to create an account on it so that you could communicate with them or maybe you have heard a lot about this app so you just want to give it a try or maybe it could be any other reason for you so whatever the reason it could be in this video I'll show you how easily you could do it also I will try to leave it in instructions in the description so you can check that as well first you have to install Evernote from Google Play Store or App Store once it get installed just simply tap on its icon to open it and then you will see this interface when you open the app now it is asking to create an account on it or maybe you can just sign in obviously we don't have an account so we cannot log in therefore we have to create an account on it so to create an account you can use any email of your choice it could be gmail it could be apple id or any other email you just have to simply tap that email address and then you have to click on this green option which is continue after that it will just take a while to load your email address and to gather some of your information from the email address that you have provided to it once it completes its buffering then it will show you this option first it will ask you to try its free version or you can buy it but you don't have to go with any of these options what else you could do here is that you could see we have a cross option on the top right side of the screen you just have to simply click on it but if you want to purchase this you can purchase it but here you just have to simply click on this option and after that it will just again take a while and greet you by just saying welcome to Evernote and then it will ask you for a few things like if you want to turn on the options or not so if you want to turn it on you can turn it on otherwise you can click on remind me later and if you want to allow it allow it otherwise you can skip that option now it will ask you that who you are are you a student are you an employee or if you are a person who works from home so you can choose any one of these options whatever you prefer whatever is most suitable for you you can click on it right now i'm going with a third option which is a home but you can choose any option of your choice you just have to simply tap on that option and it will take you to the next step now just click on continue and again it will just take a time to process and after that it will ask you that if you want to like capture an idea if you want to plan a project or if you just want to get organized so you can choose any one of these options according to your preferences then click on continue and again it will just take a while after that it will say that you have successfully created your account or it but before it will ask you to try its personal account but you can skip that by just clicking on this option and now your account is ready now you can use it and can do whatever you want to do on this app it's all up to you so this was the easiest way i know through which you can create your account on evernote if you know any other way of doing it so let me know in the comment section below also make sure to subscribe to the youtube channel for more informative videos and updates and thank you for watching the video